everybody, Mark Spect the Comics, and I'm back. This time, I want to show off my top five pickups for 2023. If you're interested in seeing what I picked up this year, stay tuned for that intro. All right, so welcome back. If you haven't already, please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Hit that bell notification so when I do put out some content, you get in a timely fashion. This is going to be a quick video, just my top five pickups. There could have been a ton more on this list, but I just wanted to save some time and show you the highlights. All right, so I'm going to start off with number five. This was my earliest pickup of the year, and we got none other but a Bronze Age monster book. Probably one of my favorites. This is Frankenstein, issue number one. This is out of CGC 9.4, and this came out in 1973. Mike Plug cover art. This is a beauty. There you go. Number five. All right. Number four. I ended up picking this up right around the same time that I picked up number five. And uh, this will be the DC book first. And uh, this is Batman, issue number 181. And uh, this is the first appearance of Poison Ivy. Great cover. That's number four. Number three. Number three was um, a book I ended up picking up right as I was leaving this comic swap. Um, had a great time. And, uh, you know, I couldn't pass this up. You know, it's just a classic cover. This is Amazing Spider-Man. Issue number 129. This is the first time I picked up this book. First appearance of the Punisher. There you go. So far I've noticed, you know, I've got a couple of uh, Bronze Age books and uh, a little Silver Age. So yeah, number three. Continuing on with the Bronze Age, number two. Tomb of Dracula, issue number 10. At a CGC 5.5, this is the first appearance of Blade. Ended up picking this up at uh, Rhode Island Comic Con, and this was via a trade. So this was pretty cool to end up, you know, walking out with this book. It was the only book I ended up walking out with that day. <laughs> and then number one, I couldn't leave you guys without a little bit of Golden Age. I had yet to, you know, show off this book. I picked this book up in the beginning of December, and... Uh, Let's finish up with some Golden Age DC, which is uh, on my list to pick up a little bit more of in uh, 2024. So hopefully you guys enjoy my number one. There you go. Flash Comics, issue number 35. Really cool cover. Um, this is at a CGC 2.0. Low grade. Um, fairly scarce book. Not many on the census. Um, I do love this Hawkman cover on there. Uh, Flash Comics in the Golden Age is known for some really great Hawkman covers. And uh, you see he's beating up a couple of guys there on top of a building. So yeah, my number one. Hopefully you guys enjoyed my top five 2023 uh, pickups for the year. If you did, feel free to hit the thumbs up. Comment down below which one you like the best. And uh, here's to 2023, and hopefully we get another great year coming forward in 2024. Until next time, Mark Spectre Comics, out.